what you should know about bioidentical hormones and how are they different from a birth control pills or a hormonal replacement therapy. So if you've ever heard about bioidentical hormones, you probably know that they are the same when we are speaking about the form of the hormone to the ones inside your body. And that's a huge advantage, guys. This is very, very good. On contrary, the synthetic hormones that are usually prescribed by your doctor, like for example, birth control pills, they are not identical. Okay, usually pharmaceutical companies, what they do, they take a hormone, they modify it slightly so they can sell it with the profit and it's legal for them and they give it to you. And this is kind of problematic because short term it can give you, you know, symptoms like, for example, acne or weight gain. But long term, it can even have, you know, more severe complications. Like, for example, it can suppress your natural, you know, hormonal production of estrogen and progesterone. But also it can give you even super, you know, like uh, complications, like, for example, example, breast cancer. And there is a lot of research that says that, you know, long term usage of the synthetic hormones is not, you know, is not safe, right? So why should you consider bioidentical hormones instead? Well, bioidentical hormones, first of all, they are identical to the hormones inside your body. So that's a good, you know, great advantage. And there is less complication side effects usually with them, okay? They are less studied, so this is kind of like a disadvantage. They are less studied because there is no money in it. So pharmaceutical companies, they don't, you know, spend money on the research. But if you are struggling from a, you know, estrogen issue or progesterone issue and your estrogen progesterone is really low, you want to, you know, optimize it with the use of hormones. This is when, you know, these bioidentical hormones can be very helpful because you can use them as creams, for example. There is estriol cream or, for example, progesterone cream. They are bioidentical, identical to the hormones inside your body. And you can optimize, you know, these hormonal levels inside your body in this way. Usually, from my own experience, I see that clients do, you know, much better on these bioidentical uh, versions of the hormones. Uh, the best way of, you know, testing it is just to consult a good, you know, functional medicine physician and consult him, you know, which form would be the best for you and uh, just assess, you know, the advantages and disadvantages of using this kind of hormonal therapy. Keep in mind that I don't recommend using this kind of hormones long term, okay? Any hormonal therapy should be used preferably short term just to optimize your levels because this, you know, has, as I was saying, advantages and disadvantages, okay? Still bioidentical form is synthetic. Even though it's the same, it's still synthetic. So you shouldn't be really giving your body this external, you know, hormonal things uh, for a longer time, right? Now, if you ask me what type of, you know, bioidentical hormones are the best, well, it really depends. There is a lot of brands out there. So again, I, I recommend consulting a doctor, but when it comes, for example, to progesterone, a good, good rule of thumb is to search for progesterone USP. This usually tells you that this is bioidentical, you know, version of the hormone. Uh, also, when it comes to, for example, estrogen, uh, in reality is actually estriol because estriol has, estrogen has different versions. You can search for estriol, you know, bioidentical cream, and you can also apply this cream, uh, you know, on your body. This should help you to, you know, increase these estrogen levels inside your body and uh, so you can feel better. But once again, remember to always consult a good, you know, functional medicine doctor he or she will help you to choose the best form of you know bioidentical hormone so you can avoid using this you know hormonal replacement therapy or you know birth control pills even and yeah that's everything if you have some questions please comment below and i will be more than happy to see you in the next video